and a tweet between famous friends goes viral. Cody is here <laughs> with your two minutes of mayhem. Uh, producer Tessa says we should probably put this one under glass because okay. this is about as mayhemy as we could possibly get. Classic. All right. This first story may not sound mayhemy, but when you think about the size of the doghouse that the husband's in, you might reconsider it. A North Carolina woman is desperately searching for her thousand dollar wedding dress, which her husband accidentally donated. <sighs> Her plea has reached tens of thousands of people on Facebook. She says she had the dress in her car to get cleaned, but hubby accidentally dropped it off at a Goodwill donation Aww. with a bunch of baby clothes. Aww. When she contacted Goodwill, she found out it had been sold for $25. Bye. And the couple is still making payments oh. on said dress. Oh. oh hey, he buddy, I got a terrible. futon you can crash on for a Oh, I bet he feels terrible. Olympic medalist Christy Yamaguchi had an insert foot into mouth moment on Twitter. Fellow Olympian Nancy Kerrigan is a contestant on the current season of Dancing with the Stars. Yamaguchi also competed on the TV show, and she sent Kerrigan a supportive tweet and said, So excited for you. Can't wait to see you grace that ballroom floor. But it was the closing remark that lit up the internet. Yamaguchi concluded with, Break a leg. Oh, my God. Oh. That could be read like poor advice for a skater who was hit in the knee by a baton exactly. by a henchman associated with oh. Tanya Harding. The famous attack happened before the 1994 Olympics as Kerrigan was leaving her practice oh. rink in Detroit, but the medalist took her colleague's statement and comment in stride. I'm sure it was, it's just a saying. She you know, didn't stride. mean anything by it. Just a thing. Stride. Stride. Right. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Why me? Why me? Why? 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 A Dartmouth man is furious that after 25 years, his personalized license plate has been canceled following one single complaint. Lorne Graber, that's his name, he's German. Lauren Gramber, think about this. Uh, of German heritage, bought this plate as a gift for his father's 65th birthday. His father passed away in the 1990s, and the plate has remained within the family. Last December, he received a letter telling him the plate would be canceled in January because the public cannot be expected to know it's his last name and, quote, can misinterpret uh, it as a socially unacceptable slogan. Got out, bro. Uh, is familiar with the infamous <laughs> recording of the U.S. Uh, President Donald Trump using offensive uh, language to say he wanted to grab her in a refer reference to a woman. Uh, but grab her said it's not Mr. Trump, and he is not Mr. Trump, and this is not the intention of the license plate. So please, let the man have his license plate. I know. Let him have his license plate. Come on. I know, but Come you on. know, this day is different now. You know, it's yeah. different now. Do you want to have explain it to angry people 800 yeah. times a day? I, I got to go get the futon ready for that guy in North Carolina. <laughs> Come on over, buddy. All right. Thanks, Cody. Five